hello guys welcome to coding simplified again and today we are going to start the series on strings so basically we will solve the problems on strings one by one from starting with the beginners level then we'll go through the intermediate and then we'll go through the complex problems right so uh, for the starting we are taking an example very basic example so for example you are to uh, given that you need to print the string right so uh, what you will do for that so for this we are using the language java uh, but we want to use the uh, inbuilt functions right we'll use for the all the problems we'll use the basic logic and we'll try to solve the problems in the basic fundamentals right so uh, this is the uh, string so for the string this is the uh, string type which is a, a string is a class basically in java so if you say string s equals to let's say you define hello world right this is your string so this is how you define the string in java and now you need to print this string right so in java we have system dot out dot print ln or uh, you can also give only the print so which means and you say just as so it means that you are printing you want to print this string so if you run this program then you can see the print uh, in the console that it is giving hello world all right as well we can also uh, give the print ln so basically print ln means uh, it start the from the new line right so uh, like if you run this program it won't be any impact but if you give any more so let's just copy this or oh, there is a, a shortcut command so if you just give and this is print again the same thing and if you run run the command again run the then you can see that it is printing in the next line right but if you don't give ln so what it will do run the program again it will print in the same line right so this is the difference between print and print ln right and similarly you can also print the some other words as well so just use the shortcut and as well this is the uh, you can give your own string here and let's say this right so what it will do it will give name okay it's not looking very good so just uh, give the print ln in the new line and run the program again right so now it is printing in the next line so it is saying name equals to hello world because uh, s variable is the hello variable hello world right but if you give your name here you can also uh, you can also declare another variable let's say a string name equals to um, let's say coding simplified right so you defined a variable st string variable name and now you want to print this so just run the program and you can see now it is printing the name coding simplified right so this is very uh, basic example how you can print this string in java right so uh, i think friends that's it for the uh, printing the string and in next tutorial we'll come up with the uh, good problem again with the strings yeah so thanks for watching the video and please like and subscribe the channel for more problems thank you